Hey guys, what is up? Goldglove here, and we're playing a game that I don't even know, because I'm not watching any gameplay. I decided to do a regular commentary because I haven't done one in a while, and I have some things on my mind. Uh, number one being, uh, Skyrim just came out, which is amazing. I am super, super, super excited about this game. I actually started a Let's Play on it, and uh, so if you guys haven't seen any of that, I will put the link down below in the description for Episode 1, Part 1, to the Let's Play. I think it's uh, turning out really, really well. Could be one of my best Let's Plays yet. If you're a huge fan of L.A. Noir, maybe Heavy Rain, uh, definitely check this out. I think it's going to be just as good, if not better. But uh, enough about that. Enough about a little plug for another series. I wanted to uh, do a regular commentary for you guys because I haven't really done one. I'm about to go out. Tonight is uh, Friday night. It is uh, Veterans Day 11, 11, 11. And uh, it's crazy to think that this date will never appear or for another hundred years. Uh, which is in insane. So uh, there's, there. It's crazy to think that someone could be born tomorrow, and they will never. They, and there's the potential that they will never witness another 11, 11, 11. Which is just, it, I mean that that's crazy. You got to think about that kind of stuff. Um, so we're here in on a special day. It is Veterans Day as well. So I want to thank every uh, veteran who has uh, you know fought for our country for the U.S and uh, who has put their life on the line for, uh, you know, for their country and the people that live there. So uh, I really do appreciate it. And, you know, that goes out to every country and every, you know, every army, military, every veteran there's ever been. You know, it's an amazing thing that we have people in this world that will support their country so much that they are willing to put their life on the line for the people that live in their home. And so that that's an amazing kind of thing. Um, but I haven't really done these uh, these kind of sit down commentaries where I just kind of talk about random stuff and I just uh, kind of talk to you guys on a more personal level. I know I've been posting a lot of live commentaries and, and the thing is for that is uh, it's very, very easy for me to do consistent uh, content when it is a live commentary. And the reason for that is I, you know, I can, it's mainly gameplay oriented. I don't really have to come up with topics to talk about. And so it, it's easier on me. But the reason I don't like doing these all the time is because um, I don't really have all that much to talk about. And I don't want to do a video and force things upon you guys. And But there was something that kind of uh, struck me today. And, and I don't know, maybe today has been just kind of a darker day than usual. It's just pouring here. It's just kind of a shitty day. Maybe maybe that is... I, I live in the state with the highest suicide rate. So uh, maybe depression has set in a little bit. Not really. I'm not depressed. But you know how it's just some days you feel a little bit lower than usual. And uh, it, it's just, I don't know, I, I just, I'm really looking forward to moving to L.A. next year and, and kind of starting fresh because I feel like, I feel like, yeah, I've got a lot of going for me when it comes to YouTube and stuff, but in the current state of where I live and, I, you know, I don't want to be rude, but to the majority of the people that I'm surrounded by in this area, um, I, I kind of want to get out and meet new people and kind of start fresh with a new, I don't know, friendships and, and relationships and stuff like that. And, um... You know, I, I do love my friends dearly. I, I love, I, you know, I have, a, I have a pretty small group of friends that I like to hang out with. Um, but it's just, I don't know, it's just amazing. And so that didn't that didn't make any sense, did it? No, Tucker tweeted me and it said amazing. So I said amazing. You know, you guys ever do that where you read you read something and then you're saying something else and it just automatically, you're, it just, you just spit it out. That's what I just did. So that's, not, anyway, uh, continuing. Um, but you know what? I, I've been getting these messages and these comments and you know everything else. Uh, people trying to talk to me on Facebook about how um, apparently I don't know. They just acting like they're the, my best friends. And these kids were from high school. These were guys that are, are people, not just necessarily guys, but girls too, who have all of a sudden under or, you know kind of gotten a grasp of what I do and what I do in life and how I'm actually enjoying myself and what I do and that I'm actually having good success with what I'm doing. And they're leech. They're just leechers. They just try to leech on to people who are successful and people who are doing the right thing in life. And it's really frustrating to see someone who treated me kind of shitty in high school and now them trying to be my best friend, trying to hang out with me all the time and trying to kind of butt their way into my life. And I have no desire to ever speak to that person, let alone hang out with them, you know. And I'm a, I'm a pretty friendly guy. I'm a pretty nice guy. I, I would like to think that I'm pretty damn kind. Um, but it's just really frustrating when you see so many people trying to leech on other people's success and trying to just kind of take advantage of it, you know? Uh, there's people who are constantly, you, you know, three years ago when I was not doing this, uh, you know, or at least I was doing this, but I wasn't doing this at the rate I'm doing it now. 
Um, they would have wanted nothing to do with me, not anything at all. Um, you know, they could care less about who I am, what I do, and what I've done. But now it's like, oh, Brennan, he, yeah, he's doing something good in life. He's actually going somewhere with what he loves to do. So let's leech on and try to take advantage of everything he can. And that is the most frustrating thing I could possibly ever see. Um, it's so frustrating when I see that happen to other people. And it's even more frustrating when someone tries to do that to me. Because it's so blatant, like, it's so blatantly clear what they're trying to do. And it's... And it's like they're, they think they're sly enough or smart enough to kind of slide by without you noticing. But those people are the worst people on this planet. They, they don't, I don't know. It just don't be those, don't be that type of person, guys. I, I mean, I really try to do videos and try to give you guys good influence. And the reason for that is because I have such a large viewership. I mean, I can potentially reach out to thousands and thousands and thousands of people with just one 10 minute video that's all it takes and I can literally talk to that many people all at once you know it's not like I have to call in a meeting and have you guys all come to one room and I try to announce it on top you know standing on a podium I can literally upload a video to the internet and it can reach thousands and thousands of people and that means that I have that much more influence over someone who doesn't have that opportunity so I'm trying to I'm trying to be smart with all this I'm trying to teach you guys lessons that I think are actually valuable in life and that uh, will actually help you possibly become a better person. Now, I won't say that I'm the best person in the world. I obviously make mistakes just like everybody else, but uh, I'm trying to take my channel in the correct direction and making sure that I, I not only entertain you guys, but I do it in the correct way and I do it in a uh, good and mature and influential way, you know, I don't know, in a, in a good sense because I don't want to be a negative influence upon you guys, especially because a lot of you guys are young. A lot of you guys have your pretty much your entire lives ahead of you. You guys are in high school. You're, uh, you know, you're between the ages of 14 and 18, and you, you know, you guys look up to me, and which is amazing. I, I appreciate it so much that you guys look up to me as sort of a role model. And maybe I'm tooting my own horn, and maybe that's not the case with most of you. But I do get a lot of messages saying that you know you guys look up to me and stuff. So when I do read those messages, I really appreciate it because it's an amazing feeling to know that there's uh, there's kids out there that were were like me, you know, that are like me. And uh, I'm kind of past, you know, I've been through a lot of things you guys have been through. I've done a lot of things that you guys have done or will do. And so I do understand where most of you guys are coming from. And so it's, I mean, I, I understand how nice it would have been to have someone to kind of look up to when I was your guys' age or a little bit younger. And even now, I wish I had someone I could look, I could look up to and kind of say, you know, that guy has his, has his head on right. You know, he is going in the right direction. So I want to be that guy for you guys. I want to be able to do that. And you know, that, that goes for everyone who's listening to this video. You could be way younger than what I said. You could be older. You know, you could be, a, you can even be a lady. You know, I, I try my best to just entertain you guys and uh, do it in, do it in a, in a smart manner. I would say. So, anyways, this video was a little bit longer than I expected. I don't know what gameplay I threw up. It could have been some Call of Duty. It could have been some Gears of War three. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video regardless. If you did, be sure to give it a like. It really does help my channel out. And, and, and for some reason, people think that I get paid based on likes. I don't. The only thing, I'm going to be completely honest with you. A like uh, spreads the video out more. So the more likes, obviously the more people who are going to see the video, which in turn means more views and, you know, more viewers for you guys and a larger channel, or excuse me, more viewers for me and a larger channel, hopefully. And so it just it just helps the channel. So the least you guys could do, I think, is just like the video. I mean, you guys already do watch it, so I do really do appreciate that. But uh, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye.